Okay, here's a multiple choice question, similar to one you might find on an AP exam. And we're asked, for the, for the function shown, which of the following is true? So let's look at the function and look at these options. Our curve does like this. There's an asymptote there at 2, a horizontal asymptote at 1, and then down there another piece of the curve. So option 1 here, the limit as x approaches 1 of f of x equals infinity. Well, 1 is right here. The function has some value there, so that's not true. It's certainly not infinity. The limit as x approaches 2 of f of x equals infinity. Well, 2 is right here. And as we approach 2 from the left, this function does, in fact, zoom up toward infinity. But as we approach 2 from the right, this function zooms down toward negative infinity, so that's not correct. Number three here, the limit as x approaches infinity equals one. Yes, as x gets really huge, the function here is approaching this horizontal asymptote at one, so that's correct. And item number four here, the limit as x approaches two of f of x does not exist. Right, when x is two, it's positive infinity on one side, negative infinity on the other, so we can't even speak uh, clearly in terms of infinite limits. The limit as x approaches 2 does not exist, so 3 and 4 are correct, so the answer is D. Here's another example. We're given a graph and we're told to find these things, and we can find these values from the graph, we don't have to have the function. In fact, we don't have a definition of the function, just the picture. So first of all, f of negative 1. Well, look at negative 1. Here's negative 1 on the x-axis. On the curve here, there's a hole in the graph right there, but this point is plotted right here. So f of, f of negative 1 is negative 1. That's our y value right there. The limit as x approaches negative 1 of f of x, well, as x gets close to negative 1 from either side, you can imagine moving along the curve toward that point, and in that case, we're getting close to a value, a y value of 1. So the limit as x approaches negative 1 of f of x is positive 1. Now, the limit as x approaches negative infinity right down here. Well, as x grows without bound in the negative direction, the function here gets closer and closer to a y value of negative 3. So the limit as x approaches negative infinity, excuse me, that's a positive 3, positive 3, right up there. And then the limit as x approaches positive infinity, this, um, this curve here, there's no asymptote drawn so even though this curve is getting steeper and steeper, it still goes infinitely far to the right. As x gets big, this thing zooms up. So the limit as x approaches positive infinity is positive infinity. And you can put a plus sign there if you want to. Positive infinity.